Hey guys, RC here, back with FM20, and this is episode 10, and we drew with Newport, and that that was disheartening. We really dominated the game, just could not find the goal. Uh, we did play some rotated people. We played Mikulski up top, uh, Williams in the number 10. Uh, we had some guys that, you know, Atchison came off the bench. I just wanted to rest a few of these guys. A few of these guys were not available anyway uh, with fitness, and I wanted them for the home stretch here, and it didn't pay off. So, disappointing, but um, we can still get it done. If you take a look at the competition, we're still in third position. Bradford is drawn even with us. We are still two points up on Crawley and three up on Plymouth. Uh, those are your confirmed playoff teams right now. Uh, Cheltenham and I believe, yeah, Grimsby's the only team that can catch them. Uh, so Cheltenham could actually secure today. But we're more worried about finishing third or higher. And uh, we've got a good chance to do that with Colchester being our season finale. But we've got to do the business today against Cambridge and this is a game that we should win. Cambridge is where? Cambridge is 19th. Yeah, just, ugh. All right, team selection. We are heavily favored. I'm going to go back to this tactic. Central defenders. All right, just let me peek around here a little bit. Let's go with a little more direct passing. Yep, we've got the six out of seven. Hopefully we can address that and have that fixed for next year. Encourage the team. Come on, boys. All the keepers are wearing pink. It's Breast Cancer Awareness Month. Save the tatas. All right. Corner opportunity. It's white. Oh, well, it took a deflection off of Taft, and that's going to be an own goal, and I don't care. We'll take it. That might have been going wide. That might have been going wide. Adams, yeah, I think it was going to go way out here. Collins might have been able to come into play on that ball, but yeah, we'll take it. We'll take it. All right, Carruthers. Good block. Pilge is there. Plays it up. Collins. Oh, good first touch. Beats his man. He's on a break in, and he slots it home. Number 24 on the season. Marin Pilge with the assist with that delivery from back in our end of the field. What a ball up. Collins with a brilliant touch and just exploded with the first step. I thought he was going near post, and he slid it past the keeper in the other direction. That was stellar. Uh, we're going to go ahead and give him some praise now, being up two. We're staying positive. Come on, boys. Coast into halftime. There we go. I'll take that. I will take that. All right. Crawl Ooh, Crawley's up 2-0. Cruz uh, drawing. Bradford is drawing. Oh, I guess I, I guess these are the uh are these the ones? I see I don't I didn't set those, so I don't know why they're there. Bradford's drawing. Plymouth is winning. And Colchester's drawing. A Colchester draw would be huge, I think. Go out and prove a point. Play it calm. Do not let this go get away from us, boys. There's a header, and it trickles in. Atchison, his 14th of the season. Oh, he just crashed that back post, and he oh he just got a toe on it, poked it past the keeper, and it's three nil. All right, uh, let's see. Concentrate. 
Let's go ahead and make a sub. We're going to pull Davis off. We'll put Bernard out there. Tell you what, let's bring Hall up top and rest Collins. And then we'll bring Mondal in on the wing. Just get a couple of guys off. Keep those legs fresh. Some of our key players. Praise. Just keep them fired up. All right, let's go ahead and get Harvey off the field. Now, he's a playmaker, so James James can pass. He's got really good first touch, so he'll fit into that playmaker role, and we'll do that. And then the other thing I want to do here is slow the pace down with the goalkeeper. Looking good. Don't let it. Blocked away. There's a clearance. Rolls beats our man to the ball. Cross to the other side. And, ooh, that was bad. That was bad. And there we go. A 3 0 win. We will take that. Uh, we are going to be passionate, happy with the result. We'll end it there. All right. So let's see. We go top of the table. Oh, my God. All right. So Crew, Crew Drew, Crawley won. So they're up into third. Colchester lost. Oh, my goodness. Where are they at? They lost 2-1 to Walsall who are in ninth. That's a big win. They've been in bad form. And that's who we finish with. So who who does Crew play next week? Crew, Crawley. I mean, all of these clubs could still catch us. Basically, though, if we win, we're up. A draw with Colchester, I think we still go up. So a win or a draw, I think we're in automatic promotion. Let's check the vision. Uh, so they're very pleased right now. We've passed. All right. So, whew. All right. Collins was stellar. Yes, he was. There we go. All right. We'll be back for the finale here. Just a moment. Well, it all comes down to this. A titanic title struggle. I need to go in and look here. All right. Fierce rivals. All right, I was trying to see if Colchester was in here because it made it sound like they were rivals of ours, but eh, don't, don't see anything in there. Don't see anything in there. But anyway, it is title day. We have been chasing our tail all season. So Stokes is out. Freer is still out. Williams is back. I think everybody's going to be available. All right. So let's see. Crew is playing Cambridge. Cambridge is near the bottom of the table. So assume they're going to win. So we need to win to win the title if Crew wins. Crawley is playing Mansfield, who are mid-table in 11th position. Nothing to play for. And, yeah, so I think a draw gets his automatic promotion. A win and, you know, we, we control everything. So we are on the road. We are favored. They are in woeful form. Oh, do I go? I think I'm going with this tactic here. They're playing four up top. Three attacking uh, attacking uh, midfielders and two midfielders and a striker up top. Uh, I'm going to edit our guidelines here, and I'm going to drop this to 80%. Then we'll pick. So that will put our best players on the field, even if they're down to 
I'm okay with that. Looks like everybody in the group is going to be at 90, though. So Atchison up top. Collins in the number 10, our leading scorer. Hall and Mondal on the wings. White and Pilge in the midfield. Davis, McGinley, Rawson, and Shepard across the back four. Smith in the goal. Kitching, Adams, Williams, Bernard, and Winchester on the bench. Let's get it done, boys. Hopefully we never have to see that again. <laughs> All right. They do come out in the 4 2 3 one. So hopefully that gives us an overload uh, for defense, win for the supporters. Um, I'm going to go ahead. I, I don't, I've told you guys I don't do this often, and I don't. I usually do it in the first game and the last game of the season is give them the little green speech. We want them out there as best as they can. All right, we're about 10 minutes in. Let's get creative. Very, very tight match. We are controlling possession, but... All right, um, let's show some passion here in the early going. Why are we both wearing blue kits? Shouldn't we be in our green kits if they're in those blue ones? That just stands to reason. Mondal runs onto it. He takes a shot. Sends it wide. Not the best finisher. Not the best finisher. Jackson, their right back, picks up a yellow card. Davis lumps that into the box. A throw in. Pills. Mondal blocked away. Brown's on the counter. He's got a man up there. Somebody cover him. Somebody cover him. All right, looks like we held him up. Good defense. Who was that? Good defense by Pills. Not a good clearance. Not a good clearance at all. Poku beats the keeper. All right, we're going to dial this up to attacking. And we're going to demand more. Oh, that's, that's disheartening. Whew, back, back post, and you know, those are always a crapshoot. Oh, boy. Oh, boy. All right, Bradford and Walsall drawing. Cruz winning. We're losing. Crawley's winning, which means that means we fall out of automatic promotion. Oh, my God. Um, yes, disappointing. And we'll do that. I'm going to come back to positive again. <laughs> Gherkin, I would have to change my name because I can imagine all the jerkin to gherkin jokes as a kid. All right, Shepard lays it off into Pilge. Collins back to the quarterback, White. It's poked away. Senior is on the counter. Uh, hello. Oh, J oh, my God, Giovanni Brown. Nobody closed down on that. What is the deal? We've got tight marking there. No, that is... All right. Um, yep, we're going to switch here. All right. Collins. All right. Atchison there. Collins up top. Hall is attacking mid, right, left. That's where Mondal's playing. All right. Uh, Mondal. Hall's not playing good. All right, so let's get him off. Is Mondal playing better? Not really, but I think Hall is our better player. Mondal, Hall. Fitness-wise, they're about the same. And let's bring let's bring Adams on for Mondal. Is he better at Okay, that's that's a better that's a better fit. 
let me just check here. Hall is left only. Atchison's right. I'm going to swap these two guys. There we go. Oh, my God. Oh, my God. Not, not, not. Show some passion. All right, there's a header out. Pills can't get to it. They're back on the ball. Come on, boys. Crossed in. Oh, good save. Cleared out. All right, Collins is there. Oh, Collins gets tackled hard by Pell. We come right back for the throw-in highlight. So this is reassuring that maybe something will transpire for us here. McGinley, Rawson, all the way back to Smith in goal. All right, we're going to have to – let's raise the tempo, and we're going to distribute quickly. We've got to pick up the pace here a little bit. All right, Davis. Nice drop in pass to Hall. Crossed over. Pilge is there. It goes over the bar. Oh, we need one back here really quick. I think there was a penalty. And Harvey White's going to take it. He is our top penalty man. I think he's got a 17 in penalties. Beats the keeper. Easy as you like. Um, do we want to make a sub? I really don't want to pull him off. Oh, boy. Oh, boy. McGinley, Rawson. Let's bring, uh, let's bring Kitching on. They're both playing pretty good, though. And then I'm going to switch him for the cover. He's just got a little more gas in the legs. Push forward. They're frustrated. We're fired up. We're going to have to go attacking here, boys. All right, Pilge. Just outside the box. Uh, he bent it, but not enough. Goes wide of the mark. Show some passion. Okay, come on. Oh, Jesus. McGinley, Bernard, Davis. We're going to switch Davis and Bernard. Kitching is still cover. Demand more. We've got to get a counter opportunity here. Um, oh, hold on. Yeah, get stuck in. Tighter marking. Should have done that earlier. I've got an invisible player. All I see is his hair. No. Damn it. So Colchester wins the title. Damn it. And we likely... No, we finished second. Okay, so we get automatic promotion. I didn't think... Okay, let's check scores. All right, Crew. Crew drew. That was huge because we were already in front of them. So we ended up even, but we won the goal differential. Plymouth. Crawley lost. Oh, that was huge. They got two second-half goals from Mansfield. Plymouth won. Crawley lost, and Bradford City. Where's Brad? There they are. Oh, and Bradford drew. Wow. I'm okay with that. I'm okay with that, right? Yeah. Lead, you know, disappointment. You know, we had the title in our grasp, but we're still getting promoted, it appears. Let's see. 
Colchester win League 2 on the final day. Forest Green and Crew have won promotion. So we've gained promotion. All right, initial budgets. We'll look at that in a second. Our best ever League 2 finish. The board praise us. White, you can have you can have a month off. We get twelve thousand dollars for second place. All right, what's our budget moving to League One? Five million in payroll and seventy-five thousand in transfer. Okay, well, that gives us about another one point nine, one point eight million in payroll. So we're we're okay with that. I can always move that around to transfer. So what I did in the, uh, I did extend a couple of guys, but I'm letting a bunch of guys go. So if we take a look at the squad, um, contract expires. Let's, uh, let's auto size that column. There we go. All right. So basically everybody above Leaf Davis and up are going to expire. A lot of those guys are, our loan players, so those aren't really counting. Doyle, Dale Grubb, uh, seven starts, 17 relief appearances. Uh, no upside with him. We're going to let him go. Dawson, two-star. We're going to let him go. He's making 100000 a year. Winchester's at 27. He might be able to be a decent backup. He can play a lot of positions. I don't know. I may look at him. We may extend him as a as a reserve but he's on a hundred thousand if he won't take a pay cut he's gone uh chris stoke at 29 just didn't play enough to warrant a six dip figure salary he's gone lloyd james is 32 he was solid for us this year but i think we've got some better opportunities uh with the uh you know that we can upgrade now that we're moving up matt mills at two hundred thirty one thousand. uh we're gonna let him go he was a player coach but that gets a big chunk off the budget and then we can also look at loanies for next year as well so next episode we'll come back it'll be a transfer special and then we'll get into the start of the season so uh let me know in the comments. What do you guys think? I mean, we kind of choked right there. We, we bottled it in that last game. I thought with their form and the way we looked in that next to last game, the first uh, game this, this episode, that we had it in the bag. And, uh, boy, they just made us look bad. So we've got to upgrade. We've got to upgrade some players. But I think we're going to have enough salary to do so. Uh, looks like we're shaving about a million dollars off of our payroll heading into next year. So that gives us $3 million in payroll, not to mention transfer budget. So I'm going to get busy looking at that, and uh, we will see you guys next season. Have a good one. Take care. Bye.